You are now cooking with Free the Keto Coach. Today we are cooking tuna melt sandwich. Man, who doesn't like tuna melt? I love me a tuna melt. But of course, we're gonna have my own little keto twist to it. So what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna go ahead and make the bread for you. Yesterday I did a, a chicken sandwich, an amazing chicken sandwich yesterday for y'all. And I didn't show you how to make the bread, so I'm gonna show you how to make the bread. And we're gonna go ahead and get that started now. Let me clean the screen real quick. That's better. This is actually for mine. Okay, we're good. So we're gonna, do, we're gonna go ahead and... So what are you doing? I'm, I'm getting the cheese for the bread, to make the bread. And this is what this is, what I'm using is mozzarella cheese. You can actually use any cheese you, you want to use, except it really has to melt. And this one's like the best one that I, that I use. I so you don't cut it into little blocks and melt it in the microwave? No, 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 definitely not. Oh. So, do you remember what the, 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 the amount was yesterday? Was it? 48 grams. 48, okay, 48 grams. So you need 48 grams of, of, of um, mozzarella cheese. And then what this is gonna make is gonna make two slices of bread. Um, I'm not real big on bread no more, and my wife ain't either, but we're just gonna go ahead and do this for video purpose. So we're gonna go ahead and put the cheese on here. Well, no. Put that oh, okay. on. Okay, so no. Gonna... Turn that on, put this on. That's what's gonna And do. then hit the All right, now we're ready, huh? Is it a zero? Yes, a zero. Grams? Yes. Okay. No. Yes, yours. Come check it out. Come do it. Guys, That's I'm not... kilograms. Okay, fix it. Right Guys, there. I'm not sure if y'all have a... What's it called? A scale. A scale for y'all food, but it's good to get a scale if y'all doing a keto lifestyle. So what we're looking for right now, we're looking for 48, 48 grams. So we're gonna go ahead and put some more in there. We're gonna go ahead and put some more in. Not right now. Jay, go ahead, Jay. We're busy, Jay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. We need a little more. Just a little more. So you have the bacon, avocados, eggs, onion, tuna. Okay, so that went, that, went, that, went 50, that went 59. So what we're trying to do is get 48. So we're gonna eat that right now. So 48, bam, right there. So this is 48, 48 grams of cheese. So okay, we're gonna, this is how you're gonna make the bread, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and, we're gonna go ahead and eat this cheese. Cheese is good to eat. Mm. Mm -mm. My wife's looking at me like, why are you eating cheese? Because it's good. All right. Now, okay. we're gonna get the cheese. We're gonna put the cheese in here like this. Okay? All right. Yes. yes. But we're not done yet. So we get the cheese. We need an egg. We got eggs right here. And remember, always get cage free eggs. Brown cage free eggs are good. Right? We got one egg. Okay? Now, on this right here, you can do the egg, or you can do the almond flour. But we need a cup of almond flour, so we're gonna go ahead and get the cup of almond flour. Shout out to my wife for holding the camera. She's so amazing. And she took a day off today. She was sick, my baby's a little bit sick still a little bit. But she's getting better. So guys, Pray your hands, pray your hands. <laughs> no, okay? I'm fine now. So so here we got we got one cup of almond flour. Alright. And guys, I didn't do a video, I didn't do a video yesterday, so I'm, I'm still trying to get my voice. It's coming back. I can feel it coming back. Alright. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna season up the, the thing. So we're gonna season up, put a little cayenne. We're gonna do a little cayenne in today. A little bit. A little bit. There we go, a little bit. We're gonna go ahead and put a little bit of garlic powder, a little bit. Dust dust, right there. All right, we're gonna go ahead, oh, we're gonna wash that out. Let's wash this right here. All right. So 48 grams of mozzarella cheese, a cup of almond flour. Yes, yes. Some seasonings. Yes, we're doing seasonings right now. What liquid are you adding? Uh, it's gonna be an egg. That's 
And that's it? Just the three ingredients? Just one egg, yes. Hold on, where's my, um... What do you want? Jordan has it. Your right. iPad's in the hallway. We're gonna go ahead and... Guys, if you haven't picked this up, you can find this, H-E-B, Walmart. It's really great because it's Himalayan pink salt with garlic. Jay, come here, Jay. Don't start acting up, guys. We're doing a video right now. Your iPad is in the hallway. Get your iPad. No, but it doesn't show Miss Coffee. Get your iPad, son. All right. Every time I try to get my voice back, they can be, they're making me lose it. All right. So well, that was get, fine all day until they so got you get, home. So you get, <laughs> hey, guys. That's what we're going to talk about. Stress. People get stressed, and that causes a lot of health problems. Stress. Is, that's going to be for my next video that I'm doing. I didn't do a video yesterday, but I'd be doing a video maybe tomorrow or maybe later on today. I feel my voice is coming back. You feel my voice coming back? So, um, stress is a big thing that everybody goes through all the time, you know? And you can't control it. So I always tell my wife, you know what? You're not going to ch change the outcome. So don't stress about it. And I know that's easier said than done, but we're going to go ahead and put an egg in here. But guys, take a moment for yourself. Do some yoga. I do yoga. People don't know. Sometimes I, I, in the morning I get up and I do a little bit of yoga and I just go away and from everything and just go do some yoga. And um, you can do that. Main thing to do for stress is delete sugar out your life. If you start deleting sugar out your life, you're going to see a big, big difference, a huge difference. All right? So usually you could do a, a spoon, but no, I don't want to do a spoon. I want to go inside of it. So we're just gonna go ahead and move it around now. We're gonna go ahead and move it around like this. <laughs> See? And what we're trying to do is look for Put like, it down, um, put that down. We're trying to look for like a, um, the consistency we're looking for is like a dough, right? So we're just gonna go ahead and put this I thought down. it was more runny. Yeah, you know what? They, people do it runny. I mean, you could do it like that, but I'm gonna put a little bit of cream in it, a little bit, just a little bit of cream. And then we're going to go ahead and do it that. This is what I did yesterday. So it's just a little bit different. Jay, go over there, please. Son, go over there. Well, oh, you hurt yourself. I need my phone, but my brother has it. You know what's going to happen? You're not going to get on the phone. You can mess with me, son. And you're, gonna, you're not going to call her. You better leave me alone. You're not going to call your friend. You better leave me alone. You better go over there. You better go over there. You better go over there, son. I don't know. You better go over Bring there. it to me. All right. We're going to do a little heavy cream. Mm. We're You're not going to use a spoon? No, I'm using my hand. I'm good. Just we're, try, we're trying to just... Uh, see? All right, guys. See? You get like a, like you, you get like a masa out of it. Like a masa, right? All right. Now we're going to go over here. We got it ready. We're going to go over here. We're gonna go over here. We got this ready. We're gonna go ahead and put some oil on this thing real quick. And we're gonna go ahead and do butter. So we're gonna do some butter real quick. Oh, Move, Jay. Move. You're, you're in my Just God, wait. You're I'm going to help you. Wait. Please, we're doing a video, son. We talked about this. We talked about this. Well, golly, man, I swear. They, they always wait for me to do something. You can swear to God. We talked about this. You can't. Thank God I ain't having no more kids. Jaden. I ain't having no more kids. I got a daughter that don't call me. And I got kids that don't be quiet. All right, guys, we're going to go put the, put the little butter. We're going to go ahead and you're going to get a piece of this like this. Get a piece of it. You're going to make a little ball out of it. And then you're going to flatten it out like this. Right? What we're trying to do is just get it like that. Let me get it out like this. Let me get it out. So you're making two out of them? Yes. Yes, because you say you want one none. Well, like last night I had just one piece and I think that was enough. You know, we don't like do bread. Like two slices is really We don't do bread much. no more, you know? So that's why it's not a, not a big thing. And they it, and it, and it don't look pretty, you know? I'm going to lie to you. I don't look, we don't look the prettiest. Well, it's, but no, it looks nice when it comes but out. But you know what? It's amazing when it comes out. 
So we're gonna go ahead and put this down. We're gonna bring this down right here. We're gonna flip this over. I got an awesome. You know, when I first bought this, my wife was like, you're spending so much money on, what's it called? Oh, waffle, waffle maker. maker. And I said, babe, you don't understand. It's not, need just, it. a, it's not just a waffle maker. You I need, need it. I need you everything, need it. huh? I need everything, right? Always need something. I need you. Mm, to hold the camera. <laughs> oh my God. I need, I need for a lot of other things. All right. I'm sure. Oh God. Camera is so, a so we're going to go ahead. So we're going to go ahead. Women can hold cameras as well, son. We're going to go ahead. We could do as good of a job as any man out there. Yeah, they can. But they we'll can. Make sure I have a better job than that. Well, it's not a job. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and do this one right here. We're doing this one. And I promise you, man, this... So you're making tuna melt, right? Yes, we're making a tuna melt, but it's not your regular tuna melt. There's nothing out there like it. I swear to God, Jay, if you don't leave your mom alone, I swear to God, Ray, son, you're making me swear. You can't swear to God. Jay, keep it up. Come on. I swear to God, I'm gonna talk to his friend. So butter. That's true. I'm on your side. I'm on your side, Jay. It's just Jay, come on, man. Please okay. send them over How there. How many minutes? Room. When it turns green. That one's green already. So let me see if that's ready. No, nope, not yet, not ready but it's yet. forming into the waffle. Yeah, they're forming already to the waffle. Okay, so, so but let's go to the tuna. All right, so we're going to go back to the tuna and wash my hands. Guys, anybody, anybody can do this. Anybody can do this. You better get it together, Jay. All right. All I ask for them is to be quiet while we do this video for y'all guys so y'all can hear everything's going on. <laughs> Instead of hearing the kids and saying, oh my God, I know how they feel about their kids. All right. So we got the tuna, and this is the one with the water tuna, okay? Don't get the oil. The oil is too messy, so we're going to get the water. Plus, that oil is probably nasty, so we'll get the water tuna, right? Then we're going to go ahead and do some, we're going to chop up some um, Purple onion, green onion, uh, what's it called? Maroon onion, what's it called? Red onion. Red yeah, onion. red onion. Red onion. Sharpen my knife today. And look at that. Woohoohoo! Y'all like, like my holy guacamole? Y'all like this? Your new cutting board. Y'all can find that at my store, man. My store is coming. My wife don't know yet, but my store is coming oh, back. Oh, I don't know. Effect. My Amazon store is coming back, guys. It's coming back. Amazon? Yes. Jay, nobody's talking, son. <laughs> No, you, you want to comment? You know what? Write about it and then submit your comments. Yes, submit your comment or go over there to, to another phone and look at Daddy's video. That's what you should do. All right, guys. I'm not on YouTube. Not today. All right, guys. So we're just going to chop the onion up a little bit. Chop the onion. How many women out there got their husband that cooks? Go ahead. I'm waiting. How many women out there have husbands that cook? Zero. Jane. <laughs> but you I know swear. what? When you become a husband, you got two comedians. You'll cook, right? Yeah. I think Jane will know how to cook. Maybe. So, what are you adding in there? Uh, red onion. Red right. onion. Is this thing ready? Do you think? What? How, how do you open it? I got it to do. Oh. No, not not. Yeah, not ready. That one's Lock good. One. It? That one's ready. Because they had different timings. It smells really good. Oh, that is oh it's browning. Ready. That one's ready. We're gonna no, go. it's, is Let's, it ready? It was more done last time. It's ready. Okay. No, it's ready. Um, Grab a plate. But it has nothing to do. Please get out of our face, Jay. They know I'm not a bad parent. Oh, that looks nice. I thought you were going to get a big plate. What did I just hear? Oh, yeah. Please hold it. Come here, come here, come here. 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 See if that's ready. He'll be right back, guys. Uh oh. 
Uh -oh. I won't tell him I did that. This one's almost ready, but not God, quite. The other one's quiet. And this one's going to shut the hell up. Why is it one one quiet and the other one talks? Like, makes a lot of noise. Really, Gilbert? What? They all have kids. What's the problem? He don't. I'm sorry. Every, every word I say is a bad word to you. I'm not doing nothing wrong. Damn. They don't behave, man. They keep on and keep on. There we go. So there goes the, what's it called again? I don't know their names. The bread is called Chuffle. Keto Hack Bread. Keto that Hack Bread. That was or something like that. Yeah, yeah, uh, a shuffle. A sh a sh a shuffle. Something like that. All right, we're gonna go ahead and do the, the tuna. So on the tuna, we're gonna go ahead and put this in there, like this. All right? And, and on this right here, on the cookbook, it will have the exact measurements. Right now, I'm not doing the exact measurements. And it's pretty much to your taste on what you like. Because a lot of times when you see a cookbook, it might not be something you like. So you could uh, substitute it or you could change it out. Some people use uh, brown mustard. I love brown mustard, but my wife don't. So that's the reason why I use brown mustard. So where the is mustard, mustard is right oh, here. Okay. We're looking for mustard. I'm going to do mustard real quick. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do pickles, zero, 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 right? I'm gonna do some pickles. Make sure these pickles fill the water out. Okay, we're gonna do some pickles. There's more juice coming out of anything. All right, trying to get the pickles out. You know what? Can't get the pickles out. Get some pickles out. Oops. <laughs> pickles just don't want to come out, guys. I'm gonna take the pickles out. That's there a lot go. already. Yes, it is. I don't mind too much relish. Yeah, but it just didn't want to cooperate. We're getting number juice out of it. All right, so we got the pickles and stuff like that. Again, we're gonna use some of the seasoning right here, which is the pink Himalayan salt. All right. We're gonna go ahead and do the, the we're gonna do Kanye. Oh, don't forget the egg. No, I won't. So we got the eggs over here. We're gonna put the eggs in there. Put the, you didn't break these out. You didn't cut this one real good. Okay. Well, because I figured you were going to go in with the spoon. I have to go. Here. No, I'll get it. Here. I can't. This. I can't. No, he needs to stop banging on the door. Are they done with the video? No, Jay, we're not done. We're almost done. So we're going to go ahead and mix it up real quick. We're going to mix it all up. For the parents that don't spank their kids, y'all need to. Man, it's just so sad that we can't spank our kids like we used to. The way I was raised, boy, I didn't play. Boy, I had that magic chunk like hitting me all the time. All the time. And we never had kids that did not listen. We had to listen. We never could make up on what we wanted to eat. We couldn't say, can you please take me to McDonald's? Can you please take me to Burger King? Definitely not. It was always, you go where I say we're going to go. You eat what I say you're going to eat. And what happened back then? I was born 71. And, you know, I was raised around the 80s. We were poor, you know. And, man, these days, and I ain't going to lie, I'll be the first to admit it. I spoil my kids. And I shouldn't. But I guess it's kind of late for that now. No, it's never too late. Well, you know, it is never too late. But, man. See, so see, I don't like tuna like that. That's way too dry, right? So I'm gonna put some more mayonnaise on it. I'm not gonna put. I'm not gonna put. I'm not gonna put mustard because if I put mustard, my, it's gonna get too sour. We don't want it to get sour. We want it just to get taste. So this is good right here. This is gonna be perfect right here. So 
So you're just gonna put it on top. And then you're gonna top with cheese and bacon. We're gonna cook this. It's gonna be in the pot. Remember we cook it up there with everything. Which pot? We're gonna cook it on a pan. That's what tuna melt. You forgot how we do it? I. Yeah, we cook mm. it all together with the, with, the, with the cheese, remember? And then we put it into the sandwich. You don't remember? No, okay. I thought yeah. it was just it's in the bread. Do, no, hell no, it's, it's a tuna melt. Hold on. Tuna melt. All right, guys, there you go, you have your tuna. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and put some avocado on it. The avocado is throughout the season right now. So we're trying to get, trying to get, well, another one sharpen my knife. But it's good, this is a good avocado right here. Look, good avocado. So we're gonna go ahead and, avocado plays a big part in your tuna melt. We're gonna go ahead and do like that to it. There we go. I'm gonna get this off real quick. So we're gonna get this off. Jordan, Jordan. He's just wrestling. I know, but these kids, man. You know what, we should have did the video when they were all in school. Oh my God, that would have been awesome, but then people were gonna not get the video because they're in school, I mean, they're a thing. So we're gonna go ahead and do this real quick. So we got all this ready. Jordan! He's fine. Be quiet, I'm doing the video. I'm trying to get done already. I'm getting done. We're gonna go ahead and bring it over here. I'm gonna go ahead and bring it over here right now. Put it over here. Where's it? Where's my, my cheese? All right. All right. We're using we're using jalapeno pepper jack. Is that it? Yeah, jalapeno pepper jack. All right. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go over here and do like this. We're gonna put a little bit oil in the pan, very little bit. <laughs> They're all waiting for it to come down. So we're gonna put a little bit, a little bit of oil in the pan. Where's the bacon at? I thought... I've never seen you do this. Yes, I've done it like this. I know what okay. I'm doing. Put a little. The bacon's in the dish right here. Yeah. This the way. This the way I learned when I used to work at the restaurant. Like we did, like we the hot one, you know. I we thought it was on the bread, and then they just no, toasted the bread, no, which no, no. made the cheese melt. No, this is the way it's always been done. You just don't remember. Put the cheese right there. We're gonna put the cheese like that. Make sure the fire goes up a little bit. We're gonna let that melt down. We're gonna put some bacon. We got the bacon already ready. We got the bacon ready. We're gonna put some bacon on it. Like that. We got some bacon on it. We're gonna get the bacon ready. So we're letting that melt. We're letting that melt right now. A good, a good trick, a good trick to let it melt. I don't have one here. Is you just put this over like that. Oh, for the steam. Yeah. So we're letting, we're letting that melt right there. We're gonna eat this today with um. What are you making, babe? What's the thing? Babe? It's a a salad with asparagus. We're making. We're gonna have asparagus salad. We have asparagus Can you get salad. the asparagus out for me? On this Just put it over the salad. No, put it over the salad. Oh. The whole thing? Yeah, just, just put some asparagus. Okay, guys. 
This is what we're eating today. I always talk to you about, oh, excuse me. I always talk to you about eating, eating vegetables and I don't show y'all. So I'm showing y'all, you gotta eat vegetables. Vegetables are really important. Vegetables play a big part in the keto lifestyle. And the asparagus were just cut and steamed for like a couple of minutes, then taken out. Cheese on top like that. More cheese? Yeah, cheese is good for you. Real good for you. I'm gonna put this on like that. Let it cook up a little bit. We got this bread ready. Look at this bread. Look at this bread. Oh my god, look at that. Perfect, perfect. We're just letting it cook up a little bit. How y'all doing guys? Who do we got up there? Who we got all there? Angel, Alicia, shout out to y'all, the Germans, Melissa, Gabriel, Gabriella, Miss Dickens, how you doing? You ready to laugh, Miss Dickens? Hold on. Uh, Christina, how you doing? Renee, uh, Red, Sylvia, how you doing? Uh, Paula, Doug, James, but well, we got a bunch of people on here. Shout out to all of y'all, man. Javier, shout out to all of y'all, man. I appreciate y'all being on here. And y'all can make this, man. Shout out to, um, shout out to Vero. She did, uh, she did the, the enchilada casserole I did the other day. Shout out to uh, Jay Cruz. He's doing really awesome. I've been coaching him. He's doing really, really awesome. His sugar went from, you ready? His sugar went from 380, I think 386. And yesterday he checked his sugar. And do you know his sugar was at 147? 147, guys. 147. And that's why I keep on showing people how to cook and, and recipes, and that's why I'm working on the book, and, and that's why I do my show, so I can help y'all guys out, you know? So here we go, we're gonna go ahead and wipe this down. This is ready. You could just slide it on today. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. This well, bring ready. the pan over. I'm gonna bring this off like this. It don't look that pretty, but I will. It's good. Oh my God, it smells good. We're gonna put the tuna melt on here. Like that, right? We're gonna come over here. We're gonna put the avocados on it, like this. And the other one will be a second serving, right? What okay. The other waffle will be a second serving. Oh, we're doing two, huh? I forgot about that. You know that's what, I'll, just, I'll do it fine. together and then I'll cut it and give you half and you get half. No, no, because it's too much bread for the amount of tuna. Okay. You so, know what I mean? Like it's... Well, okay, so there it this, goes, guys. There goes one serving, yeah. There it goes. That's the serving right there. That's that's a tuna melt. That's what a tuna melt looks like. And of course, I will be eating some with you guys right now. I'm going to show you right now. So what do you want to do? What are we doing? Finishing up. So I know, I know what I'm saying. But just put the top and I'll cut it. No, and then you throw that one's away. mine. No, no. Okay, so we're going to do another one. All right. Like, mm -hmm. I ate mine just open like that. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Like, so do you remember how I ate mine? So it's like a tostada. Well, it's just like a half sandwich, sort of. Yeah, okay. But just not showing with the other bread so I could show how it looks. Because then, you know. You, you know, can, but that's just a lot for yeah, the which, but filling. But people still need bread, though. Okay, look. That's a lot. That's what it looks like, guys. That's what it looks like. This looks way better than with one bread. Mm. Look, guys. Look at this. Take a picture of it. I'm gonna bite it in front of y'all. Cause you know I gotta show how good it is. Here we go. The bacon, the Monterey jalapeno pepper jack cheese. The tuna. Mmm. Mmm. And then you'll have salad on the side. That's fine, you'll get it in a little bit. Oh, turn off the pan. The pan's on. I'll make mine right now. Hold on. 
I'm still chewing. I don't know. But they don't see your sign language always <laughs> turning. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> She's always rushing me. I didn't even put dressing on that. Are you going to rush you? No. Still. It's good for you. Mmm. So real fresh. Real good. Hold on. They can't go yet. Remember, we, we said we'd do a thing. We got a surprise for y'all, guys. Yeah. Real quick. This right here, I'm going to show you today because I'll put it on there. I'm going to show you how to do a detox your body every day. So you get the glass. One. Two. Right? MCT oil. That's good. Right? A little cayenne. Very little bit. All right, a little bit. All right. You can use water. You can use whatever you want to use with this. Um, guys, I want to show you all this right here. You can pick this up. If y'all miss salt waters, pick this up. This is a perfect choice. It don't have no fructose. It don't have nothing that's going to hurt you. It's pretty much zero everything. You can put it in there if you choose. I choose not to. I choose to put water in mine. So we're going to go ahead and put water. And you already know what water we use. We're going to go ahead and fill it up with water right here. All right, guys? We're going to put some lemon in it. Get some lemon. Put some lemon. But we're not done yet. Now we need the magic pink salt. We're going to twist the pink salt on it. All right. Now we get a straw. You got to do it with a straw. Why you got to do it with a straw? Because you don't want to mess up the teeth, your enamel on your teeth. The best way to do this is 45 minutes before you brush your teeth or 45 minutes after you brush your teeth. After you do this, wait 10 minutes and then brush your teeth out or rinse your teeth out. Here we go, guys. How do you feel, guys? You feel like, ah, like you just, your chest opens up, ah, you just get, you get really crunk, and that's the feeling you get. Your the MCT oil, it goes straight to your liver, and it's really good fat, guys. There you have it. I appreciate y'all. We're gonna finish. My wife is looking at me like I'm crazy. She's ready to eat. So appreciate y'all, guys. Thank you. Please share my video. Keep on sharing my videos. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Keto is Live TV. Until the next video, guys, if you make this tuna melt, please tag me on it. Thank you, guys. Be blessed. Bye-bye.